Hello everybody, um, welcome to my video today. Um, I hope you're all having a good day um, and the weather is nice where you are. It's kind of a little bit chilly today. Don't know where summer went today. Um, so um, today I'm going to be making a card with some of the new products that I showed you the other night. <clears throat> and yeah, so um, let me see. My name is Anne-Marie Jakovic, for anyone that doesn't know. I'm a Stampin' Up! demonstrator in Canada, and I live in Oshawa, Ontario. Um, yes, yeah, so uh, welcome. Um, if you like my video today, if you could give me a thumbs up, that'd be great. And um, if you're not a subscriber on YouTube, if you could subscribe, because it really helps me out. Okay? Okay, so let's get... And if you join me today, please say hello. I um, always like to um, see who's watching me. And if you're watching the replay, I hope you enjoy today's video. Okay, let me just put you down to my table. Uh, let's see here. we go let's just get this situated properly okay I think we might need a little bit more light on my desk oh dear okay see here. That's a little bit better. Okay, so today we're going to be using some new paper and stuff. Okay, but first of all, I'm starting off with a Knight of Navy card base. It's eight and a half by five and a half and it's scored at four and a quarter. I'm just going to fold that. Okay, so that's just your normal A2 size card uh, in Canada and the US. Okay, <clears throat> so I'm going to be using this um, paper, isn't it lovely? I love it. I don't know if you can see the shine on it. It's so nice. So I'm going to layer that on a, a sheet of gold foil. Like this, like that. Because this goes so nice together. So let me just. Oh, hi, Francis. Good to see you here. Okay, I need to stand up and do this part because I just have to. Okay, and that. And then we're going to use some of this lovely ribbon that we had that I showed you the other night. It's gorgeous. So I'm going to put some of that on before I attach this. Let's put it about here, I think. And then we will attach it to the card base. How are you doing Francis? How's the weather in Scotland? Mm. Get that 
up here. Okay, so now we're going to do a little bit of stamping here. Oh, where did I put my stamps? There they are. I just washed these, so let me just get a cloth to dry off. Okay, so this is from the Stars at Night uh, stamp set. So I'm going to be using this sentiment and I'm going to stamp it using Night of Navy ink. about here there we go I really like the font in this <clears throat> the ribbon thought uh, the weather is wet I hope to make cards tomorrow Christmas ones okay good I love this ribbon too Okay, so then we're just going to get my little machine over here. Put this out of the way just now. So the die, this is one of the dies that, that coordinates with this stamp set. So it fits just this just lovely. Just put that on. Let's just move that a little bit. Oh, it's moving. I tried to do it the opposite way from what the way I usually do it. Okay, let's. Let's just line that up. properly I'm going to use some of this post-it tape so that it doesn't move Uh, no, the fires actually are in um, in BC. They're in um, Yellowknife. It's terrible, but it's not near me. But um, yeah, I've been seeing a lot of people having to evacuate. Uh, yeah, it's not good. Okay, so this is that. I just love this. Okay that there and then we're going to use this is a die from the daisy bundle the um what's it called cheerful daisies um so i thought i thought this would work nicely with for this card so i'm going to do it twice i'm going to do it in gold and then i'm going to do it in very vanilla little pieces like that and then I'm going to 
you do it in a vanilla. What else am I doing? Oh yes, I'm also going to cut another layer using this die. The same die I used for the sentiment. Where is the marker? Don't do that right. Okay, so now I have two pieces right here, and then I have this next piece right here, which I will explain in one minute. So this one I'm going to put behind, like so. Okay. Bring this card back down. Okay, let's just put some adhesive on the back. And then we will let's bring this down a wee bit more. go on here but first of all I'm going to I'm going to use a little strip of this this is the uh, what's it called more dazzle it's called more dazzle so I'm just going to put that one here like that Let's use some. Actually, no, I'm going to use this. This out here. It's a shadow, and I don't like it. Oh well. Okay, so now I'm going to put this on with dimensionals. Where did I put my dimensionals? pieces we're going to put getting all tangled up with each other. I'm going to put one here and another one here just gives it a little bit of extra. I've got glue on the back. Very vanilla on first. Oh, look, put this on, monkey. Silly me. Ah, can never get anything straight. I'll have to fix that later somehow. Okay. 
isn't that nice and then using the little trinkets from the new catalogue oh, I can't believe I put that on wonky okay so then this piece I'm just going to put about right here like that I don't know how the lighting is the, the lighting doesn't look good it looks good over on my laptop but it doesn't look good on my phone camera but anyway so that's the front done and then we're going to do the inside layer going to stamp it with night navy again um using where's the other one merry christmas Merry Christmas. This one right here we want to use. Uh, let's give this another one, a little wipe. Okay. It's a little bit wet, but hopefully it's going to be okay. Christmas and then I'm going to stamp using this stamp right here put one up here and then down here okay so then let's glue this down I really like this little this little stamp right here so anyway that's my card for today hope you like it also want to show you something else that I made today so I made this as a little um, Christmas tree ornament I don't know if you can see it properly Surely. And then it's the same on the back. So I think I'm going to make some of these as gifts at Christmas time. So let me know what you think about that. Okay, let's move this stuff out of the way. down a bit so you can see it better oops there we go there what do you think about that I'm really happy with this little ornament um, the, the gold hoop that I used is actually retired um from stamping up but i found some in my stash so i used it but i was looking on amazon and you can buy them on amazon so that's good to know so why does it not look very bright here well hopefully it's bright enough for where you have it so let me just change the view here mm. 
am I doing? Here I am. <laughs> so yeah. Oh, I always put this the wrong way. Oh, no, that way. I really like this card. I'm quite happy with it. And then the little ornament. Whee! <laughs> So if you have any questions about today's project, please please put it in the comments. And um, well, you usually make something for your friends, Francis. Yeah. Um, yeah, so at Christmas time, I usually sell some Christmas cards and things like that. So I'll probably, I'll probably um, make some of these ones to sell as well. Anyway. So I hope you have a great rest of the day um, and then um, have a good weekend. And so I will see you all next Wednesday on my YouTube and Facebook Live on Wednesday night at 7 o'clock. Okay, so and uh, if you don't have a demonstrator, I would really like to be your demonstrator and help you any way I can. And if you need a catalogue, don't forget to reach out to me and I can get one to you if you live in Canada. Okay? Have a great weekend, everybody. Okay, bye.